The defense headquarters says its troops of Joint Tax Force Operation Delta Safe and other operations in the south-south region of the country have continued to sustain the war against all theft, illegal refineries and other criminal activities in the Niger Delta through aggressive patrols, raids and clearance operations amongst other activities. The director of defense media operation Major General Musa Damademi who made the disclosure on Thursday while reviewing the progress of military operations across the country in Abuja, said his troops raided and identified criminal houses at different locations within Isoko South local government area of Delta State and arrested eight suspects, two AK-47 magazines, three G3 rifle magazines, a pair of woodland camouflage with beret, eight mobile phones, Bofang radio, substance suspected to be hard drug, and other sun-dry items. The interdiction operation was conducted at an identified terrorist enclave at Tumbotun Triangles in Jambwa local government area of Borno State. The operation was carried out following intelligence reports that revealed the stockpiling of weapons and supplies at the Tumbotun tri Triangle to sustain the Islamic State of West African province and Boko Haram terrorist activities. It was further revealed that the location is one of the enclaves from which the terrorists launched attack against the Medugri Dambwa general area. Hence, the location was bombarded and reliable feedback revealed that several of the terrorists were neutralized and their weapons and structure destroyed in the airstrike. In the same vein, another air interdiction operation was conducted at identified Islamic State of West African province terrorist enclave in Baraga and Dogon Chukum, both in the southern and northern Tumbuns on 20th February 2023. At these locations, intelligence revealed that terrorists were converging and massing up to plan attacks in the general area. Consequently, the location were targeted and bombarded. Reliable reports confirmed that several of the terrorists were neutralized in the airstrike. Speaking further, Dan Madime said following intelligent report that revealed the gathering of some wanted terrorist top commanders and leaders who had assembled at Madara Mountains to re-strategize on their terrorist activities, lead to air interdiction operation which was carried out at the location. It said the feedback revealed that the airstrike dealt a massive blow on the terrorists as several of the terrorists were reported to have seen neutralized, including some of key commanders while others escaped with severe injuries. In the conduct of Operation Octopus Grip and other operations in the south south zone of the country within the weeks in review, recovered and destroyed 61 illegal refining sites, 289 storage tanks, 167 ovens, 19 dugout pits, and 13 wooden boats. Troops equally recovered 250,500 liters of automotive gas oil. 75,000 liters of crude oil, 2,000 liters of premium motor spirits, 20 assorted weapons, 359 variety of ammunition, 10 vehicles, 2 speedboats, 2 pumping machines, and 2 airboat engines, while a total of 142 suspected criminals were also arrested. All recovered items have been handed over to appropriate authorities for further action. The military high command commendations and troops and other security agencies' efforts in the various tier tiers of operations across the country.